some random Dark Templar and carrots. You're a Dark Templar, you're meant to be cloaked. Come on, carrots, help. That works. I say there's a lot of cutscenes so far. Carrots is just like Oh no. <laughs> I am honored to have the opportunity. This is fortune we cannot ignore. Indeed. Come, we must go at once. <clears throat> the spear of a doom lies dormant beneath the heart of the conclave. I had hoped to raise it to secure our victory against the Zerg. There's some cannons here. Some cannons and stuff here, anyway. Solendus. I thought we got Solendus. I guess we save her. The first power cell is activating, but the remaining four have been disabled by creep. I see. We have no choice but to clear them. What of our defenses? Unfortunately, they are without power. However, the Spear of Adun supports his Or, you know, us. just warp pen a pylon. They will allow us to deploy pylons anywhere oh. on the battlefield. We should deploy one here as soon as possible. Yeah, yeah, come on. Okay, so the Nexus starts with a Chrono Boost. These photon cannons can How much is it? 75. Point, they require only a pylon That's quick. To you can warp in a pylon using the Spear of a Dune. Press the Deploy Pylon button at the top of your command screen. Our cannons will now fire upon enemies within range. If they become damaged, the shield battery on, will Carrots. restore their shielding. These defenses will indeed be vital to our evacuation. But our first priority must be to clear the power cells of creep. Zergling bioforms on the next is fine. We must rally our defenses. My meditation. I am the heart of cold. Brought this actually quite a lot. Well, I lost one cannon, but I lost a cannon and a zergling. Almost both cannons. I think we might need some more. You have not enough minerals. I am detecting unpowered warp gates nearby. Alternatively, a pylon next to them would restore okay, their hold power, on. giving us an advantage. The spear of a dune's deploy pylon ability would. Yeah, that's what I'm going to use it for. Of course. Our probes can always warp in pylons as well. Warp gate online. We can begin warping in warriors from it immediately, Hierarch. Still stalkers. I'm here. Match that out. Chrono. Got another cannon. Let's go read this one.
I'm honestly not too fussed about zealots in this mission. We need stalkers anyway for mutalists, so let's order my stalker. I think I might have said we may need zealots for it, but no, that's not right. They are dragoons. Okay, they're just armored mechanical. I'm gonna do another battery down here. The second power cell is active. The spear sensor array is reacting. Do not deny your death. They're probably gonna attack now. Your people have finally found true unity. Have they though? Very well. Sensors online. I knew it. Wait. What is this? Warp prisms approaching our nexus point. Stalkers, eliminate those warp prisms. Shadows. I was hoping to get one of them down. It's taken a while to warp in, though, so. What's over here? Okay, you actually warped in quite a lot. Can't quite one shot dragoons. Two shot. I knew it. Did I not say they would attack? That's not wrong. That's not the right bit. There we go. That's a lot. Oh, Banelings. Oh no. I'm gonna need some more of those. Uh, I don't have a probe. Just go in, warp that, go back. What's up? What's up? That's a bit too many. That's an ultralisk. This is when it is good to have zealots, but we'll be fine. I brought another warp gate online. Prepare it for immediate use. What? Oh Christ. I didn't even know these guys were coming in. Could have been worse. Could have been better. But could have been worse. I know. You keep telling me. Alright. Get some more. Oi, leave that alone. And when's it, Joe? What? Oh, Christ. They're actually holding this. We're gonna lose a cannon, probably. Actually, we didn't. I don't think. Of course. I'll just put another one here then. Nice. 
I ain't bad down this way. I think the other warp the other warp case will all be here. Who was in Marvel? Gonna bottle net from here. That's actually a base, I think. Gonna back out. <laughs> Why are they still chasing? Right, wait here for a minute. Ah, that's probably where they came from on that side then. And it's not a base, it's mineral pickups. I should probably open this up, but if I do that they'll probably attack me, so... I just left it. Do I need to put a cannon on this thing? There's like two Zerglings. I can't even stop them coming this way because it's a hive. All the way up here. Very well. Back again. Are they? Oh, there's hybrid actually. Okay, we need to get back. Ah, uh, actually. Actually. Seems to be okay. Shield batteries didn't work. I mean, they're empty now, but I'm gonna put enough pile on them. Oh god, these immortals are gonna do a lot of damage. Right. Back to the other side. Yeah, no wonder they got through the cannons. Right, back over here. Uh, cannons. They actually didn't go for the shield batteries. Knew it was here. Abandoned warp gates are now under our control. I'm here. Right. Now, we're going to get this. An idol. Oh, it's this one. Uh, sure, it's patrol. Technically, not idol. Right. They're probably going to attack now. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh Christ! Nidus worms, warriors, strike them down. We are not defeated yet. What? Camelot Street. I've not really fiddled about with the sentence that much, I basically just picked the blur and went with it. I don't think it's at max though. You done here? I actually don't think we lost any. Yeah, I'll just put one here then. Oh god, so many stalkers. I don't think this mission will take much longer. Oh god, bundle. And now they attack. Great. Well, if it's not Ultralist, then they can probably hold it. It's speechless. Great. <laughs> oh my god, the pings. Oh, they're killing my probes. And there's hybrids coming in on this side. Oh, great. Uh, 
Thanks, Stem. Very cool. Don't tell the Nexus. I need that. Can't bloody move past the buildings. Okay, hybrid down. Things down. Can you stop? Just gonna group up here and just go for these power cells. I need to warp in more to get this one though, because there looks to be quite a lot. But with what we've got, we should be able to do this one. How are the audio levels, by the way? Because I did change them about a little bit. Which was mainly because of StarCraft. But still. I might have to change them again if we're going on Apex. Stop with his airlines, come on. We just need to be real quick with this. Madness has come. Cease your struggle against the salvation high. Here are the zealots first. Spring on all the units, mortals as well. Send in the carriers at the same time. Lost more than I would have liked there. You require my skin. I would just have to blink. Our pylon is under attack. Your probes are under attack. It shall be as you say. I hate fighting hybrids. The fact that they just keep sending in Banelings and Zerglings as well is just annoying. Alright. I should have this. We've lost basically everything apart from these units here. But as long as I don't have to do anything else, I'm fine. I've done it. Please. Oh, thank God. Power transfer completed. The Spear of Madun is ready to depart. Let all first men free from Amon aboard face me. We must flee this world. We have to survive. As you command. Leaving a lot of corrupted Protoss behind. And away it goes. Cutscene. Again. Yeah, Selendis is, uh... She's still on IR. The Spear of a Dune. A marvel of Kalai engineering. Basically left her behind. But she was corrupted, so... I'm, I'm sure we get our back at some point. Within its chambers rest contingents of zealots, Templar who bravely sacrificed, entering suspension so that they may serve as this vessel's army. Though it pains me greatly, I have begun severing their nerve cords. The ship's lower decks contain a star forge capable of constructing weapons of war. 
There is much to learn about this vessel. Its technology is ancient, yet highly advanced. We are aboard a relic from a glorious time when our Lens culture shined as a constellation. The celestial array has been updated, Hierarch. From here, you may select our next point of travel. With this vessel, we will avenge what has transpired, Carax, and we will free the Templar. Will we now? We will see. Basically, at the start of the mission, I'll save and then exit. They're already here. Hierarch, Shakuris is overrun. Loss of life is extensive. Yeah, we did like a Dark Templar on the ship. I can't remember her name. That's the one. Vorazun, that's what Matriarch Vorazun, what has happened here? What do you think? Shakuris has fallen. The warp gate linking this world ah. to Ire has been reopened. Countless hybrid and Zerg pour from the other side. They've obliterated our cities, decimated our Shadow Guard. We are trying to evacuate the remaining population, but I am uncertain whether we can hold long enough to get them safely away. We will give you the time you need, Matriarch. My Templar are inbound. And we did our Templar. Hierarch. Oh, right. Before our armies engage the enemy, War Council. Wise to review our military capabilities within the War Council. Talk to people first. Even without the Kala's light, I can sense your sadness, your pain. Does the Spear of a Doom bring you no joy? That is just it, Hierarch. Without the Kala, it is as if I am blind. I cannot sense your feelings, know the true depth of your thoughts. I cannot call upon the surety of other face smiths. I am alone. I feel the isolation as well as the thrash. Your hands are huge. <laughs> space. But you are not alone, brother. To think the Dark Templar have endured this existence all this time. The days ahead will not be easy. We may not have the Kala to rely on, Karax, but we still stand as one. We will endure. There is no other option. Farazan? Farazan. The Templar were tracking your invasion on Ire when we were cut off. Then the warp gate opened. What happened, Artanis? Amon we done drift. To seize control of the Templar. I could feel his rage tearing through me, and I was powerless against it. Zeratul found me. It was there Rip. that he... Rip in peace, Zeratul. He... Yes. He tried to free me, and he succeeded at the cost of his own life. He fell by my hand. It was Amon's deed, not yours. Zeratul came to me with a warning, but I did not act. Because if you listened to Zeratul, he would be alive. But at the same time, we wouldn't have the Spear of Fadun. But we would have whatever we had before. Cannot be easily lifted. All right. What's the war council? Oh. A preserver released from stasis. She still bears her nerve cords. What? She's tethered to the collar. Hold. Rohana. And preserver of the Valari, and your war I do not remember Rohana. Rohana. You must be the executor in command. You are not possessed by the Dark One. How is this possible? I feel darkness lingering at the edges of my every thought, but I am not corrupted. Obviously. Preservers of my station have trained to control the Kala's every rebel. I assure you. I will stave off this evil and serve you better by doing so. 
Okay. Ah. Well, you're obviously not in stasis. I am Artanis, Hierarch of the Daylarm. I lead all that is left of our civilization. Your memories are indeed of use, Rohana. But make no mistake, if you fall to this corruption... <laughs> Carrard's just standing there like... To destroy you. I'm here. <laughs> it is understood. I am prepared for the Firstborn's darkest hour. Come, let me show you what may be done here. Quite a view. The assembly panel awaits. Talk to you first. I heard only tales of the Grand Preservers. I did not Don't know why Grand Preserver is. Obviously, festival. she is, but. That is not surprising, Hierarch. My sisters and I are unique. Trained from birth to master every intricacy of the Kala. I have experienced its true depth, plunged the infinite spectrum of emotion and memory. It is because of this gift we were selected to enter stasis, so that we may guide you in our most dire hour. Your sisters were aboard the other Ark ships? Then they are dead. One with the Kala, fallen during the Zerg invasion of Ayr. Which was quite a while ago. I know this. I feel the tragedy that has befallen us more deeply than you may realize. A terrible burden has been laid upon you, Rohana. Yet it is my fate to bear it. A fate foreseen by the same minds that constructed this vessel. I trust in their wisdom, Hierarch. I will serve my purpose, much as you must serve yours. Okay. What do we do? What do we get? Select. Oh, this is where you select them. Yeah. And then you get the... Purifiers. Alright. Standard Zealot. You get Charge and Whirlwind. 10 damage per second to all nearby enemy drone units for 3 seconds. Or Centurion. Intercepts and attacks enemy drone units also increase the speed. Intercepts and briefly cloaks the Centurion. They also have Dark Coil. Stuns enemy. Stuns target enemy ground gen, all ground units near it for two and a half seconds. We are the blades of the Shadow Guard waits. Try the Shadow Guard. Right. Stalkers are dragons. Bonus damage to armor, bonus damage to armor. Oh, I can't not take dragons. High damage, high amount of life. Tate Centurions and Dragons. <laughs> 